an instructional video detailing the applications and functions of the Phase 2 Digital Micro Vickers Hardness Tester with Auto Turret. These hardness testers are designed to test primarily metals using the Vickers Hardness Method. They are state-of-the-art, precise testing systems suitable for hardness analysis of metallic specimens in metallography laboratories or production environments. Now let's move over to the operation of the hardness tester and see how easy it is to utilize the different functions, taking tests, and obtaining results. Very first, when powering up the machine, keep the number one button depressed until the PC link shows on the machine screen. Let's begin with the unique design of this series hardness tester. Here we have the weight load selector, the manual optic system with left and right measuring drum wheels, though for today's demonstration video we will use the digital optical system you see installed here on top and connected via USB cable to a laptop. Here is the XY stage with digital micrometers, a Z-axis manual height and focus control, and the control keypad used for A, B, and C version software systems. When using the D version, as we have here, the software is in complete control of the testing procedure. No keypad is necessary. Note that should anyone prefer to use this system without the digital optic system, they are free and able to do so. Manual optics with drums are in place and keypad can control all aspects of the test. However, today, it is quite rare to bypass the easy use of a computer screen to see the indentations clearly and work with data in a digital format. Let's take a look at the software interface on our laptop here, which is connected to the digital camera by a USB cable. HV on top left. Go to Measurement Settings. And you will see the force should match your weight selector settings on the machine dial. The test blocks that you have come with the machine have suggested weight loads to use. If you intend to do noob scale testing, the checkbox must be marked here and your penetrator must be swapped from Vicker style to noob if you don't have a multi-penetrator turret. You can set upper and lower test limits, reporting format, and others from this screen. Now let's make sure the digital camera system is working and connected. On the top left, click on Capture. Then click on Image Capture Window. Then click on Devices. Select the R-Tray camera. Next, move to Options and select Preview. This will open a preview screen and confirm the camera is working properly. Then close the preview screen. Taking a test is as simple as affixing your test block on the XY table. Bring up the test piece by turning the manual Z axis wheel until the screen shows the position area you want to test. Continue to bring up the part toward the optics until a coil effect is realized. Once past this point, the surface of the part and the test area will soon be in focus. On the software screen, press HV Start. This will begin the indentation process automatically. The software will control the position changes of the turret. Once the indentation is realized, mouse select a square area over the indentation. Select Auto Measure if using the B or D version software and the reading will appear along with any converted value if so chosen. If you have an A or C version of the software, there is no auto measure button. One must choose to measure either using diagonals or points on the screen. B and D versions come with auto measure. Once your test is completed, you can move the position of the digital stage micrometer to find another position to take another test. Let's review more of the digital interface. On the top right, we have Refresh, then Auto Measure, then Measure by Diagonals. We can delete the last reading, select Data File Locations, 
We can generate a report. We have image library and conversions. And below, we have hardness results in a table. And then below that, we have settings and parameter changes on the fly in statistics, machine control, hardness curve, conversions, corrections, and others. This concludes our application and function guide for the Phase 2 900-391D Micro Vickers Hardness Tester. Should you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us. Thank <laughs> you.